Randy, <laughs> you better with the bull, you're gonna get the horns. Cody's gonna put a hurting on you tonight. Hey, he's not just gonna take the title, but he's gonna take your record as the youngest ever world champion, and I'm gonna be at ringside enjoying every moment of it, just like the proud papa that I am. There's plenty of me to go around for the Rhodes father-son duo. If Dusty shows his face at ringside, he should eat an RKO. It's no secret how these two feel about each other, but tonight it's bigger than that. Tonight it's about the World Heavyweight title. And not only is Cody hungry for that title, he's also got the American Dream in his corner. There they go! They lock up. Do you realize Cody could become the youngest world champion ever tonight? And we both know who holds that distinction. Randy Orton. Here we go. Iris Whip. Fightful like Randy Orton is just so scary when he realizes he's in control. Talk about a move with bad intentions. Raising shot there. He's left the ring. This could get interesting. What? Oh, what a classless act by Orton. Not that we should be surprised. What? Not like Dusty was a threat out there. He was just supporting his son. Well, that sure fired Cody up. Here they go! He's going to the top rope. against Rhodes. Oh! Now with complete control. Oh, he's going for the eyes. That's such an effective move. Another roadblock for the age of Orton has been utterly demolished. Cody Rhodes put up a hell of a fight, Michael, but Orton would not be denied. We hope you've enjoyed No Way Out. See you Monday for Raw. Welcome from Philadelphia, home of tonight's Monday Night Raw. Michael Cole and Jerry the King Lawler here, and we're hot off the heels of No Way Out. What a mean event we had last night, Michael. Cody Rhodes really stepped up his game, but he could not become WWE's youngest ever world champion against Randy Orton. Both superstars are likely spent from that match, and I bet they're hoping to have an easy night's work. I see Randy Orton coming to the ring right now. Tired or not, he never misses a chance to gloat. Last night, at No Way Out, 
you witness the lone legend get even stronger. Cody lasted long enough to give you people your money's worth, but we all knew he didn't have the goods. You only need to look at his daddy to know he's at one level, and I am way up here. The age of Orton is unstoppable. I feel like a million bucks. I look like a million bucks, and there's not a person walking this earth today who can... Speaking of a million dollars... It's true, Randy. You are pretty good. In fact, you remind me of me when I was in my prime here in the WWE. I had a chip on my shoulder. I was on top of the world. Don't say that, Ted. I'm a multi-time world champion. The only time you ever got to this level was when you tried to buy it. You never reached the top. And neither will that spoiled trust fund kid of yours. You know, I remember when you were in diapers, running around the locker room bothering us superstars. You've had that same snot-nosed attitude ever since, Randy. I thought you'd have grown up a little by now. I won't waste much of my breath here, because you're not going to listen to what I had to say. Just remember, everybody's got a price, Randy. And for some, it's not always money. <laughs> 